What is up, everybody? Lion of Hyrule speaking. Welcome back to another video of Dragon Quest Echoes of an Elusive Age. Last time we were playing, we met up again with once again with Stelbando after the little tree fell. And are now in Porta Balor. We just found out that Salvando wants to rejoin our band of merry groups to talk, take down Morgan, and that he is also the son of Don Rodrigo in Porta Balor. Hence, why we are back here in Porta Balor. Uh, we are going to apparently ask Don Don Rodrigo to watch after his band of parade men. So that he can do that. Um, so if you like what you see, hit that like button, subscribe, and we are now going to continue on with the story. Without further ado, game on. Just making sure I was going the right way. Now, if I can just find the Dawn, that would be fantastic. It also turns out, too, that uh, the reason we just found out about this was because before Salvando left Porto Valor, he and the Dawn had a um, very, very nasty uh, argument. And, uh,. They left on not so happy of terms. And, uh, Turns out they haven't spoken to each other since then. So this is going to be a fun, interesting read. Don Rodrigo, it is I, Hendrik. It has been too long. Uh, huh? Hendrik? Ho ho ho! How many years has it been since you completed your training, eh? Come closer, caballero. <laughs> Let me see your face. It's Spanish for buddy. I have heard many tales of your exploits. <laughs> To think that the great lump of meat who came to me all those years ago is now the hero of Eliador. <laughs> hey now, that's not nice. I had not expected to find you in such good spirits, my lord. As one who owes everything to your kind offices, it pleases me greatly. Alas, there has been precious little cause for mirth since last we met. Dundrasil fell, then Yggdrasil. And now the Lord of Shadows roams the land. Don Rodrigo and I have much to discuss. Perhaps you could go and fetch Silvando while we talk. Okay. So looks like we've got to go find Selvando. While Hendrik speaks to 
Don Rodrigo. Let's see. I was still. Where would I be outside? Just a thought. down the big staircase at least to the sea. Okay. So I was right he was over here by the sea. Oh my god, serious I didn't even see him. Oh hey honey. I guess they sent you to fetch me, huh? Yep. It's so silly, I know. Here I am, happy to go put my neck on the line in the fight against the Lord of Shadows. But I can't even face my own dad. The of facing Poppy makes me want to run away screaming. Doesn't make Seeing sense to me, but... his father in Phnomnon made me think I could do it. That I could finally face him. But now I'm here, I... I'm so scared. I get it. It doesn't make any sense, but sometimes heard what there are things with him, I guess. that don't make sense. Um, did I? A little bit. Hendrik told you, huh? Yep. <laughs> it all seems so far away now. Even before I could walk, I was training to be a knight, you know? I would stay in Puerto Valor and follow in my father's footsteps. Then one day... The circus came to town. It happens. We it all don't. It was so, so fabulous. I can't even describe it. It was love at first sight. We don't follow any father's footsteps, and I sometimes we just that, that I'd found my calling. We have different Getting interests. Getting up on that stage and making people happy—that was the life for me. But it's only but temporary. Bobby, he wasn't so keen. A few plates got smashed the night I broke the news to him, let me tell you. Uh... But... Yeah. I wasn't going to let that stop me. Oh no. This was my calling. To make the whole world happy. I would be a knight in smiling armor. Ha. Ha. Actually, that was pretty funny. I think about it. He didn't have anything to say to me after that. <clears throat> That was when I knew that I had to go and prove to him that I meant what I said. So I left. And I haven't seen him since. All because of grudge? Ah, dear me. Wow. That got a bit long and emotional, huh? Not as long as some but people. It's made me feel a whole lot better. In fact, yes. Let's do this. It's now or never. Let's go pay Papi a visit. 
L lose the Mardi Gras costume, please. I can't take you seriously with that and the whole, like, yeah. It's kind of freaking me out a little bit. See if I can find some armor that would be better suited for Dragon Hawk. Hi, Dad. Hi, puppy. Uh oh. Caramba. Norberto, you dare to show your face in my presence. And you have come to tell me something. See? Si. See? Si. I'm so sorry, puppy. Sorry, 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 sorry. So, so sorry. Sorry? <laughs> what are you apologizing for? Foolish boy. Huh? You have succeeded in making the world smile, see? Uh, not 
yet, Poppy. Close, though. Then why are you here, hmm? Why did you come back if you have not yet done as you promised? You said you would do it, Norberto. You said you would make everyone happy. I did not raise you to be a failure. How dare you come to me and... Puppy! Damn you, boy. If I were younger, I would put you over my knee. What kind of a knight makes an oath and does not fulfill it? Wait. Puppy, did you say... knight? You still think of me as one? You have no idea how... Oh, thank you, Puppy. Thank you. I guess it wasn't very knightly of me to come back before I'd fulfilled my promise, huh? But I had a good reason. Indeed. Don't we always? The Lord of Shadows. See? Yep. See? How can I make people happy if he is there making their lives miserable? It is impossible. Yeah, it kind of makes it hard. Which is why I'm going to beat him. Only then can I fulfill my vow and make all the people of the world smile again. <laughs> Careful, boy! Do not promise to defeat Mordegon if you do not truly intend to do so. I will not have you break another oath. Of course, Papi. A knight's word is his bond. You taught me that. It is true. But there's just one teensy weensy little thing I need to ask you to do to help. I've picked up a few friends on my travels. They're kind of young and kind of innocent. They need a role model, you know? Someone to lead them. <laughs> you do not even need to ask, Norberto. A knight serves the weak untiringly. Or have you forgotten the pledge? <gasps> oh, Papi, really? Really? Come on, Norberto. Of course, it will be my pleasure. Oh, aren't you just the sweetest, kindest father a boy could hope to have? Mm -hmm. Oh, darlings! Come say hello to your Tio Rodrigo! Oh dear. Hmm? Hmm? Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, oh, what a lovely bedroom. It's so big. <gasps> oh, don't tell me this is your dad, Sylve. He's awfully manly. I'll feel safe with you looking after me, Mr. Rodrigo. Uh... Yeah. <clears throat> Alberto, explain yourself. What is the meaning of this? <laughs> now, Papi. Let's just pop this on. Oh. Hey, Norberto, where are you? Hey, 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 get your hands off of me! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Such a foolishness, boy! I did not agree to this! <laughs> oh, don't be like that, Papi! How can you lead my little band of boys if you don't look the part, huh? You promised. It's true, you did. And didn't you always teach me that a knight's word is his bond? Huh? Uh, uh, oh, Dang it.
Oh, that's embarrassing. Soldiers of Smile, you serve my puppy now. You must do as he says. Do not fail me. <laughs> Please, still don't go. Don't leave us. <laughs> oh, darlings, it breaks my heart to say goodbye. Truly, it does. But we have to be strong. As soon as Mordegon is defeated, I'll be right back with you. I'll be home before you know it. You'll see. <laughs> and no matter how far I go, no matter how hard it gets, I'll always be with you. Always. That's embarrassing. Oh, Sylph, we'll be with you too. Just say the words and we'll come running. No, I just can't. Thanks so it's much for your help, darling. I'm all yours now, I promise. Yay! The Salty Stallion is all yours too, of course. She's anchored off to the east of here. Okay, we'll head east. With the ship at our disposal, other places will be accessible to us. Perhaps now we can seek out your friends in Arborea. That's the plan.
get the experience points going. Well, all right. this goliath then we're going to take out that maiden and we're going to go to the step is ours.
let's go to somewhere I guess Victory is ours. Everybody. All right, let's head. Sales, darling. Not long now till we're through the strait. Indeed. Hi, <laughs> Eric. What the? Who's that rattling around in my cargo bay? Would you be a sweetie and go check? Sure. I'll go look. In here. I brought the whole gang just in case. Huh? Eric? Honey, is it really you? You're alive, laddie. I knew you would be. Oh, this is the best news we've had in a while. You can say that again. It's wonderful to have you back, isn't it? Yes, yes it is. I... I'm sorry. For what? 
I hadn't eaten anything for three days. And, and I saw you loading this boat with food, and, and I just couldn't help myself. Um, are you okay, honey? <laughs> Eric, you look like you saw a ghost. Something is not right. Is this really your former companion? You... you said Eric, right? I, I'm pretty sure that's my name, but... Do I know you or something? Not him in particular. Don't you remember us, laddie? You're all partners in crime. I, I'm sorry. I don't remember anything. I woke up and, and everything was dark and I had no idea who I was or where. I remember my name and I know there's something important I have to do. But apart from that... Look. I know I have no right to ask you this, but could I tag along with you guys for a while? Oh, absolutely. If you know who I am, it might help me to remember something. I promise I'll pay you back for the food I took. I'll swab the decks, clean the dishes, anything. <laughs> no need, Eric. No, no, there'll be no need for that, laddie. You stick with us. I'm sure your memory will be back soon enough. Indeed. What do you say, darling? Shall we forgive our little stowaway and welcome him back with open arms? Thank you so much. I promise I won't get in your way. You won't regret this. You weren't in the way in the first place. I wish Veronica were here to see this. She'd die. Aha. Uh -huh. North we go. was never in doubt. All right, everyone's all healed, ready to go.
That wasn't very nice. There's Morgan's castle. See if I can conserve Dragon Hawk Sympathy for now. Things have a lot of MP or HP. Not at all. We did it, darlings. Seventeen. Holy crap, Eric. Swordmaster, okay. Holy stink, man. go. Fight wisely, everybody. Yeah. 
kill Eric, that's right. Not bad indeed. Good job, good parry. Last it, I'm already asleep, man. Carried the day. My strength grows ever greater. Here we are in Gondolia. We're going to make a little bit of a pit stop here. We were told to uh, go to Zadrest, but we needed to uh, do something. We needed to make a pit stop here first to be able to heal and get supplies and stuff like that.
And with that, here is where I will stop this video. Thank you for watching. This has been my of Rule. Next time we play, we will be picking up in Gondolia. And, um... Continue on with the story. Until then, I will get to you later.